Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel Go Dynamic IT. If you are a business owner or entrepreneur working with a critical data, then this video is for you. Today we will learn how to protect our pen drive, external hard drive or SD card with a password and all without using any third party software. So let's dive in and secure our data. So you can see here, this is, uh, this is the Windows 10 PC. So let me show it to you. Go to the properties here and uh, you can see this is the Windows 10 Pro PC and I have a pen drive connected to it. This is 14 GB pen drive here and inside the pen drive, I have lots of data here. You can see here, I have a family photos. I have a business data. I have a customer data. I have a factory plan, I have a layout plan, you have a password and all. And, and I have one small database file also. You can know these files are very important for the business. Or if you have any file related to a business or personal, and you don't want to share this with anyone, right? Because these are all, you can see here, these all are critical data. So this data can be misused by someone, right? And I do not want this data to be misused. Imagine a situation that if your pen drive gets lost somewhere, right? This is your pen drive, this could lost somewhere and somebody used that. Somebody can use that in his computer and copy all the data or it can misuse all the data. So what you can do is, so you can protect your pen drive. So how do we do that? Let's do that. So we have to go to our this PC and right click on this and click on the show more. And inside the show more, you can see turn on the bit lock, turn bit locker on. So this is, uh, this process is same for the Windows 10, 10 as well. If it's, so whether you have Windows 10 on 11, right click on it and select on the turn bit locker on. And it's saying that uh, choose how do you want to. So I want to use this as a password protected. So let's protect with the password. Let's give the password here and click on the next. And it said, do you want to save the key? So this is the recovery key. So what happened is like sometime if you lost the password or sometime you don't remember the password, right? So when you have this backup key, you can recover your password with the help of this one. So you have a three option. You can save on the Microsoft account or you can save it to the file or print the key so let's this save this file somewhere okay let's save this file into the my document oh so you can see here um, see i can see here the c drive is my encrypted drive and i saying that when i try to save onto my desktop it says that you cannot save this file on an encrypted drive okay this is this is the troubleshooting point for us so it should be somewhere into the unencrypted drive so let's save in the google drive we can save it yeah we can save it able to save into the google drive or you can save in the microsoft account so let's click in the save in the microsoft account also so we'll have we'll have this key on the both the location the microsoft account also and on the um, google drive also i have already shared a video with you how to recover your uh, bit locker key from microsoft account just go ahead and watch that video on my channel so click on the next you have a two option here the worst first one is say there's the faster one and the sec second one is the so you say that the compatible mode here in this uh, select encryption mode we have a two option new encryption mode or compatible mode so, so we'll select the compatible mode because this is the pen drive or external hard drive right or sd card will keep moving from one device to another device okay and as you can see there is written here also click on the next and select on the start start encrypting so this is going to encrypt that this is not going to take much time because we do not have a much data here. I mean, uh, I mean, this is having uh, very less data here. This is just for demonstration purpose. So let's see uh, how soon it's going to finish that. Okay, done. You can see the lock key. So encryption is completed, right? So on since we are on this PC, we can easily use this pen drive. Now I'll show you the magic here. So imagine that we lost that uh, pen drive and somebody got that pen drive and he's trying to connect on it onto his Windows 10 machine. So I showed you, right? This is the Windows 11 machine. Let me disconnect it from here and connect it to the Windows 10 machine. So let me disconnect that. Okay, so this is my Windows 10 machine. Let me log in here. Okay, so this is my Windows 10 machine. You can make it out from the interface itself. You can see this is the Windows 10. And okay, let me connect my pen drive here. Okay, so you can see here, I have connected this pen drive to my Windows 10 machine. This is the Windows 10 machine. And it says that uh, this UF, the drive is connected with the letter of F. And let me open this, this PC and you can see this drive and it's showing the lock. So somebody even lock, you can see this drive is bit locker protected. So somebody get my pen drive and try to connect it to his computer. First, he will get, he will get this lock option. And when he try to open it, double click on it. You can see in the corner, it says the password protected. You have to key in the password, then you can use it, right? Isn't it a useful for tool for you? This is the lifesaver, right? 
you cannot afford to lose your personal data or your business data right you gonna this is the social media age so people can very badly use your personal data or your business data right so let's assume that this is asking for the password now think about the second scenario this is the shared computer right you are sharing with your office colleague or somebody else right this is a shared assume that this is a shared computer and you have a data this data on your pen drive right which you have this which is your personal data or your maybe the business data and you know you don't want to share your data with your colleague right am i right right so what you do when you don't want to share this data with your colleague you protect your so even those devices let's say um you miss this data connected to this computer and you shut down the computer so somebody else tomorrow somebody else came in to the office and then he open the computer so once you open the computer he see this drive connected he do, he can see that this drive is connected to his computer but when he try to open that it ask for the password so every time when you connect or disconnect your pen drive to the computer and if you want to open it you have to use the password or if you shut down the computer reopen it if the device is connected your pen drive your ssd or memory card whatever it is if it is connected it is going to ask for the password and without password this is not going to open here i can see this machine was shut down i just reopen it and it's asking for the password i did one more test i just remove the pen drive and reconnect it and after that when i try to access this it was asking for the password right so let's give the password now we can open this pen drive and we can use the data right so hope this video is informative for you right so thank you very much for watching the video see you in the next one